flexing, yeah. Cause I just checked my bank account and I'm good. I'm flexing, yeah. Cause my singles going off in my hood. I'm flexing, yeah. Everywhere I go, you know it's all love. I'm flexing. Yo, what's good, Crazy Nation? It's your boy, Espirep the Crazy. You know what it is. I'm back again with another reaction. This is to Maestro of My Heart by Kiss of Life. Let's get it. Let's go. Now, hate on. Hate on. About to turn your kingdom into ashes. That, that tone suits Nutty, especially with like the auto tune. The fire is burning on my beat, no capping me, no That is my favorite part of the song. Hanul's part here. I love the way she sings this. Jesus, Hanul. Oh my god. in her Ariana Ariana, Ariana Grande bag. Is that scary that for a second I thought that was Ariana Grande? Like, is that a compliment or is that a slap a backhand? Like, I don't know if, if I'm saying that as a compliment or a backhand. Do you know what I mean, Magic, by that? Like, I feel like, like, I am saying it as a compliment, but as well, I'm conflicted with it. I'm going to say something. I don't like this part. I really don't like this part at all. I like this part. I just don't like that small section. The we the queen that did that. That we the queen of the. Oops, I don't like that part. 
And I don't like this part. The give me that do re me playing that bit, but I don't know. I just don't like it. Like I get the point of it being there. I just just don't like it. Now for me, magic is that's a hard part to sing live. I can picture it live, and I'm not going to like it. That's my problem. You gotta remember, whenever I listen to this stuff, I always think about live stuff. And I feel like that's gonna be hard to sing live. Really hard to sing live. If they do ever sing this live. to be there because that classical sample is so unrelenting you need a similar thing in the instrumental but i'm not talking i'm not complaining about the instrumental and stuff like that i'm just complaining about that part the instrumental and all that's perfectly fine i'm just talking about the i just don't like the way it's sung that's what i'm talking about i just don't like it at all like this i don't like this either this is this is another thing. I don't like it. You know what's another thing as well? I hate doing this with Kiss of Life. This song reminds me so much of Maestro. Like massively. Yeah, like yeah, the title didn't lie, yeah. Like I like it though. I like what they've done. It just remind, like, there's some, there's a bit, just little bits of similarities. It's just, you know me, Magic. It's just sometimes I look for little nitpicks, but that's it. I love this part. This is my favorite part of the whole song. I was about to say that's my favorite part, and then Bell does it too. Ugh. Nice. My question is, what was this for? Oh, it was for Stage Fighter, right? Do you, if you want my perfect, honest opinion. I wish this was their title track. Even though we haven't heard the title track yet, I feel like this song could have been a title track. I hate... What I've noticed with Kiss of Life is all my favourite music of theirs could have been a title track. And they just weren't put as title tracks. Yeah, I know what it is, a dance focus survival show. I remember I remember what stage fight is. But yeah. Like I would have loved to see what they would have done with a music video of this song. If you get what I mean. Like that actually intrigues me, but Knowing our luck, we probably won't get anything for it. <sighs> I don't know. I've been struggling with Kiss, Kiss of Life late, lately. I reckon it would be an ama I reckon it would have been an amazing comeback. Not not even a good comeback. That is the perfect comeback after fucking um. What's it called? Sticky. It's a it's the sound of kiss of life that I like. Even though like there's little nitpicks, I still like it. I like it a lot. I'm curious to see what type of kiss of life we're going to get now. I'm curious about this comeback. When's this comeback?
that's the thing that intrigues me. When's this comeback? It's soon, right? I'm just curious to see what type of kiss of life are we going to get? Um, what I really liked about this song, though, was the use of all of their members. Like, I like, there's certain parts I really, really enjoy. And then, like I said, there's little bits that I just, I just like, I don't know, like, I'd rather something else. October 4th, pre-release, music video, October 15th. All right, cool. Huh, we'll see. I'm curious. I'm intrigued. Like, this has brought me back into the, like, enjoying Kiss of Life. I'm like, okay, they're in my good books again. If ever, if anyone wants to know why they weren't in my good books, is I didn't like Sticky and I didn't like Tequiero, both songs. I didn't like either of them, and I haven't liked Midas Touch. So that's yeah, that's free. That's three songs in a row that I haven't really enjoyed. But yeah, I'm keen. I'm keen to see what's next for them, and I'm keen to see where they're going to go. I'm weird. No, I'm not weird. It's just. Te quiero. I can't. I'm sorry, Major. I speak Spanish. That That is a pet peeve. That is a. That is actually a pet peeve of mine. That, is, that annoys the fuck out of me. When. Someone uses a word. And then they try to change it. For it to suit. Musically, I hate that. I like, I hate it, but yeah. Um, Midas Touch, I don't know what with Midas Touch, I liked it at first, and then I don't know what happened for some reason. I didn't like it after Sticky. You know, my damn reason why I don't like Sticky to me, to me. The perfect example to explain Sticky is they struggled to sing it live. And I think Midas Touch is, might be the same reason. I like bits and pieces of Midas Touch, but then there's other parts that I don't like as well. But yeah, man, that's all I've got to say. So if you like this, give this a thumbs up. None of that. Comment if you want to see more. Subscribe and remember, keep living a crazy life and stay blessed. Peace. Laters. Ah, uh, whoop.